Right, now we've created our texture, displacement and normal map, we're going to export them. So what we need to do for the texture map, and you can do these as and when you do them, you don't need to produce all three in a row, but what I want to do is clone it and it'll appear over here. It'll also appear over here in the texture palette. So here it is, here. So what we need to do in Maya is flip the V and we need to export that straight out uh, onto my desktop into my work and into my cyborg packaged I'm gonna make it a TIFF file and I'm just gonna call it texture and then save that out I'm gonna do the same for the normal map coming to texture I'm going to flip the V and I'm going to export as normal of course if you had different characters you would name it maybe cyborg normal cyborg one normal and then name the uh, exported uh, OBJ file uh, the object itself as um, as the same so that you would know which is which okay so we'll save that now we want to clone this displacement which will appear actually up here we need to go into here and we need to make a texture this will appear here then and allow us to flip it go a bit into my texture I'm gonna flip the V and I'm gonna export it as displacement and also save that out as a TIFF file okay and finally we need to export out the actual model itself so I've got the model here and I've got him selected he's in subdivision level 1 I need to just go and change a few of the export settings so if we come down to export I want to make sure that all of these merge UVs export subgroups don't need the text the texture or is it will export that and we want to come down to preferences import export and you want to make sure all of these are unchecked that's good and then I'll come down and I'll export this it'll be an OBJ file and I'll call it cyborg zbrush and I'll put that in the package file as well so the last thing we've got to do now is just create a texture of the eyeballs so I'm going to do new from poly paint I'm going to clone the texture here I'm going to flip the V's I'm going to export as I texture and save that out as TIFF file then I'm going to make sure that I'm on my lowest subdivision levels which only have one subdivision level anyway and I'm going to export these eyes so we we'll call this eyes and that ends this part of it so I'm finally going to turn these textures off come down to here just display this off, display this off that's already set, turn my poly painting back on and increase my subdivision levels 
and finally just save this out as thirty two and I'm gonna put this as final and that's the last file in that sequence and now I can close this down and in my package files I've now got everything ready to take into Maya so I'll see you in the next lesson where we'll look at uh, putting this together in Maya